Okay, as of today, I am going to be showing you some of my Jump the Cat characters. Um, I ended up like improving them, so I hope you like them. I also finally got some new characters, and they're my friends. And some of them are just extras, like random people. Okay, so... Here is the first one. I kind of scratched that out, so I just made it into a design like that. Only the first three people have that kind of design. Not the scratch, but a design. So here's Jump. As you can tell from the super long tail that spells out Jump, I don't know how to spell a J in cursive, so I just did that. And at the bottom, it says Jump or Badger. Now, the reason why I put or is it's the name and then the nickname. And then, as you can, as you can see, I am dressed as a badger. And then the next one, since I don't know, the next one was someone who actually volunteered. The only person who actually commented, who only comments on my stuff, I decided to make them into a character, but. I don't know, because of the name, I said, I, I don't know, the name, I kind of, like, put the colors on, on my own, so. Dark, and it's this dark or shadow, so. My friend wanted to be shadow, but I was like, mm, sorry, you token. So, I ended up making, this one has a teeth colored neck, necklace, or not necklace, but, like, collar. Thing. I have red eyes and stuff. It's an all black cat with a white tip tail and a white belly and a white muzzle and white ears. It has red hair, red eyes, and red stripes and stuff. The next one is my bestest friend in the entire world. She likes the color black and red and purple. So, I decided to make all those colors into one. Well, I gave her the second good name, called Maple. Maple or Raven. She has flame, um, socks on, with like that, and stuff. I could have made it darker, but apparently I didn't get the chance. I also made her tail look like a flame and stuff. I am horrible at coloring. <laughs> I also made her eyes red. And then it's another character, it's another friend. She is obsessed with mayonnaise. I have no clue, I, I don't know why. So I ended up naming her Mayo or Crooked since she has a weird, she's awkward. So what I did was, I ended up getting some lines and I ended up making them crooked to show her personality as a crooked character. I made her all white for her love of mayonnaise. And then the other one is... My friend that we nicknamed her the Human Cocker Spaniel. The reason why we I nicknamed her, nicknamed her the Human Cocker Spaniel is because her hair was all wavy like Cocker Spaniel ears, and at the tip it had that tiny like curl, and it was super, and her hair was super soft. So I ended up making her into a Cocker Spaniel. So her name is Orima or Wave, as her ears show it. And then there's the, one of the extras who kind of bothered me to the bone. I didn't give him a nickname because um, there is no nickname for him. So I just called him Tillman. Tillman or Tillman. I made him to a mouth because he's super short and he has glasses. And then here's his friend. I forgot the glasses. <laughs> his name is Freckles. He has no nickname. He's going to be all white with little orange freckles because he's a ginger. And then this one I didn't, I couldn't color it because I got too sleepy. His name is Jerky because he's a freaking jerk. And it's Jerky and Nod Nard. He is awesome. So I suppose that is it. And I will get to you soon on one of my drawings and stuff. So, see you later.
comments. I'm tired of not having comments and stuff.